3, 2, 1, stop. Hey everybody, it's Riku Go, and in this video, I'm going to talk about five reasons why you should move to Cyprus. You will learn about the Cyprus lifestyle, climate, business, and tax benefits here in Cyprus, as well as culture and nature. This video is for you if you're moving to Cyprus, planning to do so, or if you're just curious about it. For me, moving from Germany to Cyprus had many benefits and I'm going to talk about the biggest of them to you now. So it's definitely going to be interesting. Watch this video until the end because we are going together on a bike tour now to better show you what I mean. Let's grab the bikes and then I'll see you outside. So far, let's go to the beach. One of the first reasons why it's so interesting and awesome to live here in Cyprus is the lifestyle perspective. Living in Cyprus, you can really feel this beach, island, feelings and vibes and it's really just relaxed here especially at the night time when you're done with working you can just go outside meet new people from all over the world there are a lot of students here so meeting new friends is very easy you can start conversations here very easily as well and also in the morning you can just have a casual bike drive or a walk or even doing some meditations or a yoga session right at the beach and that is just an awesome feeling to know you can do this whenever, wherever you want. So lifestyle is definitely a good point for Cyprus. And now let's move on to the next point, which is the climate. And even though I'm wearing a shirt, we can still do some muscle ups and then continue our bike ride. All right, let's continue. All right, we made it to the harbor and now we are coming to the next topic which is actually one of my most favorite benefits about Cyprus and that is the climate. As you can see, I'm driving around in a shirt and it's just April and for a person that is coming from Germany, that is just awesome. Especially if I talk to my friends that are still in Germany and they send me pictures that it is snowing right now in Germany. It is just awesome to be able to go at the beach already or maybe even soon go into the water. And there is nothing I have against snow because I love snow actually but the awesome part about Cyprus is that you can also go into the snow and snowboarding and skiing up at the hill in the Trodos mountains. Especially in December and January and February it is very cold up there and you can really go snowboarding or skiing as I said. And the winter is like two to maximum three months and especially in December, January and February, but it is never colder than like 13 degrees. For example, this year, the coldest temperature was somewhere around that. And the summer starts somewhere around April. So at this time right now, it's gonna be very warm very soon and then it's gonna stick like that for a long time. But it's not as hot as in Dubai, for example, where it's sticky just because you have the ocean or the sea here and you can just, go into the water, have some fresh air. It is still very hot. Last year it was somewhere in the highest temperatures like 40, 42 degrees, which is very hot. But as I said, when you just go into the water, it's very refreshing. And to me, I love climate. I love warm cli climate countries. I lived in Bali before, and now I'm very happy to be able to live long-term in such a great country with an awesome climate like Cyprus so let's go as we are at the harbor right now into one of my most favorite cafes here in Cyprus and grab a cafe and then we will talk about the business and tax benefits of Cyprus now we are coming to a very big topic and that is the 
business and tax benefits of Cyprus. And before we start, I want to mention that I'm not a tax or legal advisor, so I'm definitely going to be making it short, but I'm gonna tell you what I know and what was interesting for me in the beginning as well. So those business and tax benefits are especially interesting for digital nomads, internet entrepreneurs in general, as well as self-employed people. Because if you incorporate a Cyprus limited company, you underlie a corporate tax of 12.5%, which is considered low for a lot of countries from let's say the US, Canada, Germany or, the, or other high tax countries where it's at least double that amount. So for corporate tax reasons, it might be a nice side effect to move to Cyprus as well as dividends. Those are tax free here in Cyprus and the same goes for capital gains, which is especially interesting for traders, for example, forex traders, because Cyprus is also a hotspot for those people as well. But it's important to say those benefits are only if you trade as an individual and not in the name of a company. The capital gains exemptions. Also in Cyprus there are a lot of investment opportunities, especially for real estate. If you drive around Limassol or also Paphos currently, you just see a lot of new complexes, houses, offices are getting built at the moment and you of course can also participate in those in the growth of Cyprus. Also, it is awesome that a lot of digital entrepreneurs are currently moving to Cyprus. They already live here or they are planning to do so. There are also a lot of meetups here and communities for like-minded people and people that just want to talk about business and growth in general. So those people are also from all over the world. So you will definitely also have a community for your home country, which I have for my German community as well. And talking about people, let's get to the next topic and that is culture and people of Cyprus. When you walk around Cyprus, you pretty quickly realize that we got people from all over the world, from the US, the UK, Germany, Denmark, Asia, and pretty much everywhere. So wherever you're from, you will find people and friends from your country as well. And you pretty quickly also realize that the population here is bilingual. So you definitely don't have to worry that you don't speak Greek. I myself don't speak Greek yet, but I can communicate even with the natives because basically everyone here speaks English and even an elderly person here that I used to talk with and we were talking about Cyprus and about her story, about my story. She was so nice and friendly and we could definitely communicate in a very easy and understandable way. So all of the people here, they are very friendly, relaxed, calm, sometimes even very relaxed. So if you have a meeting with the plumber at three o'clock, he may be showing up at four and he's saying that he's early. In Germany, it's different. If you have a meeting at three, you, you're late if you're one minute too late. So definitely you have to get used to the relaxedness and the calmness, but after all, this is healthy, right? So also about the culture, it is very religious here. We have a lot of big, beautiful churches here, as well as great Greek food here. And also the native people, they are very welcome. So you don't have to worry about that at all. They are very interested in your story. You can talk with them. You can get to know other people. And after all, the culture and the people here are very nice and friendly. You will love it. And let's get to the last point, and that is nature. And in Cyprus, you never know what's gonna happen. You even meet some random goats at the beach, living their lives. What a beautiful day. Before I first moved here to Cyprus, I was actually a little bit worried. I thought that it's gonna be very dry here because of the hot climate and there will be only palm trees as you, as you would have expected. But I was even happier when I realized that it is actually also very green here. And you have beautiful forests here, green sceneries, especially the Trodos, which takes up almost half of the island. So you will definitely have a lot of fun here and you will also see a lot of nature here. And in the Toros, for example, you can have awesome hike tours, you can visit beautiful natural wonders such as a waterfall, such as 
lakes and even more things like that. And then we of course also got the beaches. Sandy beaches, beaches with beautiful big rocks and much more like that. So I hope I could give you a great insight into the beautiful island of Cyprus. I'm very happy to live here. And if you have any questions, leave a comment below. Make sure to subscribe to this channel, leave a like, and I see you in the next video. Thank you.